You're supposed to be taking. <laughs> Welcome. I'm gonna take this back here. We need to take this front railing off and put that on. It's gonna be fun. Most of you may or may not know, but when the wife starts hinting that something needs to get done, she like starts asking you repeatedly, but she hasn't like gotten mad yet, that's usually an indication you need to do it soon. Toddler rail. It's big girl things happening today, folks. Big girl things. We'll see y'all in the next scene. Bye. CC. Bye. CC. Bye. 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 Just had a scoop and a half of pulse. I'm getting ready to go do deadlifts. Now I'm gonna have some BCAAs because I'm I have like like I've not eaten much today. I've had like literally a protein shake with some um, almond butter in it. So I'm gonna have some branched chain amino acids in uh, 16 ounces. 20 ounces of water while I uh, lift. I always do two scoops. My affiliation ambassadorship with BPI has come to an end. Um, it's not, it has nothing to do with whether I like the company or not, uh, or their products are bad or anything like that. It's just that the relationship was no longer working for me. I want to try to seek out a relationship with Legion. Um, and there's many reasons I can get into over a long period of time about that, but uh, I want you guys to just know that, that like BPI is legit, it's good, I like their products, it's just not for me. Legion's more for me, so that's where I'm going with it. Alright guys? Alright guys, I'm only going to record deadlifts today, because today's a pulling biceps day. I'm going to play some music. Let's see what it plays. I don't know, what's it going to play? I don't know! We're gonna find out at all costs. Come on, Pandora. Oh, jeez, Philip Phillips. I'm gonna play the Chain Smokers radio. One, two, three. Well guys, that's gonna conclude the workout. I know I didn't record everything, but I'm trying to vlog. I'm not just trying to do a workout video. I'm on my way to two places right now. I'm about to leave and go to Verizon. I wanna try to see if uh, they have a deal right now. They've had one this week where you can change in, exchange in a good working iPhone 6 plus or 6 for a 7 plus. So I'm going to go check that out, see how that goes. And then I'm going to be going and getting some food from Mission Barbecue. It's an easy to show with the weight of the world on my shoulder. It says that I can take a uh, iPhone 6 Plus and trade it in for a 7 Plus. So the guy's like, oh yeah, yeah, you could do it, you could do it. We get all the way down to the point of like, where we're gonna do the thing and then he's like, He's like, oh, you still owe money on your six plus. And I'm like, well, yeah. I'm like, I'm like, it doesn't say anything about paying off the phone. It just says like trading it in. So I'm assuming that I'm gonna get like some sort of decent value, which is gonna pay off the rest of this phone and then put some money down like, or some money off on the new phone, right? No, not like that at all. You literally gotta ha pay this off today to get that and then get that deal. <laughs> Monica got steak and uh, sweet potato. That? And that's the cobbler. Oh, you got me a cobbler? Because it comes with it. Uh...
Or you had to get another side. You were paying what for it that? anyway. Sauces for uh, it. So yeah. But it you're smells sharing delicious. Your fries? No. Oh! I'm sharing cornbread though. Right okay. there. <laughs> well, maybe we'll share some fries. I don't know. Aww. But I got turkey, fries, <clears throat> ribs, baked beans, and then uh, cornbread. And we're also watching the new Jack Reacher. Uh, we're like halfway through. We last night we were watching it and we literally fell asleep in the middle, both of us. <laughs> you left. And me then alone. I proceeded to ditch Monica. So. So that's what we're gonna do. Good morning guys. Getting room ready to take Downy, to have her hair brushed, trimmed, cleaned up, stuff like that. She it's been maybe three or four weeks now, so just making some coffee to go. And then we are heading out the door. Downy, stop looking. Dog drop off. Check. I need some guac. But yeah, this is my breakfast. So the bread I'm using, guys, is this right here. Um, but yeah, so we got the, this this guy here. Um, the macros on it: 2.5 uh, grams of fat. 21 grams of carbs, seven grams of uh, protein. But yeah, this is what I'm gonna have as my first meal here. So as you guys can see, I kind of ran my numbers, figured out what I'm eating in total. I was able to cross off my first meal of the day uh, and part of my third meal of the day. I'm gonna devour this, but this is, this is quite literally flexible dieting. Why? At its best, right here. Nap time, CC. Dad has been lay here with you for a few minutes. Okay. Just posted a picture on Instagram, guys. If you've never seen my Instagram, let me just show you it here. Here it is. It's under the name Jonathan Walsman Fitness. You'll see me under the name Jonathan Walsman, but uh, got a bunch of different photos on there and stuff. Just posted, uh, it's a BLT, but I didn't have any tomatoes, so I used avocado, so. Yeah, so right now I am consuming meal number two on here. Um, it's 40 grams of protein and 24 grams of fat. Um, so all I decided to do was basically eat eggs and egg whites. Because today's my, like I showed you guys, my hot, high fat day. So there's the meal. So that's what I am doing right now. And working on... Uh, some YouTube a little bit. I've been uh, doing some comments today and catching up on other people's videos and stuff. So, witness and behold, truly the art and mastery of Downey. Watch, watch what Downey can do, everybody. <laughs> Stop. Go to your bed. Now. This dog is a thief. <laughs> and that's how, that's how you properly steal something. Yeah. <laughs> All right guys, so we are finally to the squat session of the workout. And that's one of the things, you know, in terms of sharing the journey is sharing with you guys kind of some of the highlights of it because it's just a lot to try to show you every little detail but we got uh 270 on the bar bar plus the plates and uh, i was doing 280 and then 275 and because strength has decreased a little bit over time this is where i'm at right now <laughs> I know you made it in the nick of 
calling for me and who I am and the, my frame and my body weight. 270 is pretty good. I'm about 160-ish. So, yeah, if I could get, you know, up to 315 regularly, that'd be really good for me. So, all right, we got two more to go. And I also want to try to show you guys overhead press today. King of soldier, my eyes are clean, no secret. I wanna know, was it serious? I need it clean. I use the Rise wrist straps, and the reason why I do that is because my wrists, like, they're actually rather tiny. Um, and when I, like, for my my shoulder mobility under the bar is like kind of terrible, so. That's why you see me have such a wide stance with a low bar grip like I do. So for me, my for my wrist to be comfortable enough to do a low bar squat like that, I have to use these straps. Now, in the beginning, it was terrible. But as time has gone on, I've gotten better and better and actually started to move my hands in more on the bar. Um, that's why you see a lot of people, their like, arms are like right up here and they're low bar squatting. It's because they have really good shoulder mobility over time. Uh, so mine will just continue to improve, but it's one of those things that takes years to accomplish, so I just want to show you guys that. I thought that was like super important. I keep my time in a pocket. I want to find a new keeper. I like the way it's mysterious. I think I found. With the weight of the world on my shoulders I know I told you It's the best slot I know It's not a game that I am playing Thank you so, so much for watching the video, guys. I love that you took a couple of moments of your day to come watch the video. It means so much to me. Don't forget to click right here below. Yeah, right here. There'll be a subscribe button. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. That way you can get updates and you'll have notifications right in your email saying when the new video is launched and it means the world to me because it lets me know that what I'm doing is a value to you guys. It lets me know that whether it be in the form of entertainment, tips, tricks, whatever that you find valuable in my videos, uh, it lets me know that what I'm doing is value. And once again, don't forget to like, don't forget to comment, and don't forget to share the videos on your social media. Thanks a lot for watching guys. Peace.